When you dive deep into the ocean, you never know what you're gonna find. Some people run into stuff that's just plain creepy, while others have experiences that totally freak them out. From weird discoveries to those spine-tingling moments, here's a lowdown on some of the creepiest things divers have found under the sea. Legendary Giant Squids Back in 2006, a bunch of adventurous divers decided to crack the code of those enigmatic giant squids, lurking a mind-boggling 1,000 feet beneath the waves. So, they geared up for an up-close and personal encounter with these sea legends. Now picture this, one brave diver gets a bit too close for comfort and ends up in a bit of a tangle with a 4.5-foot humbled squid. Let me tell you, this squid was not in the mood for making friends. It latched onto the diver with those long, powerful tentacles, looking pretty darn angry. After a couple of spine-tingling moments, the squid finally decided to call it quits and let go of the diver and the camera. Mission accomplished, without any harm done to our intrepid explorer, of course. Legendary Oarfish Picture this. Jeremy Wade, our fearless explorer of the ocean's enigmas, found himself in the middle of the sea one dark and silent night. Armed with nothing but a trusty chain as his anchor, Jeremy took the plunge into the mysterious depths. But here's where it gets really intriguing. Out of the abyss, this long, slender, and otherworldly creature suddenly materialized before his eyes. It was none other than a colossal oarfish, stretching up to twice the length of Jeremy himself. Now, oarfish are known to be rather elusive, seldom venturing anywhere near the surface. So, this encounter left Jeremy completely dumbfounded and utterly amazed. Magnapinna Squid In a recent HD ROV exploration, researchers stumbled upon a rather peculiar sight at the ocean's depths, a collection of string-like appendages lurking on the seafloor. But what might have seemed like an oddity at first glance turned out to be a magnificent 21-foot-long creature known as the Magnapinna Squid or Big Fin Squid. This lanky marine dweller sports eight arms that resemble spaghetti strands and two distinctive tentacles. Scientists believe that these tentacles are adorned with tiny suckers, which the squid uses to capture its prey in the abyssal waters. Here's the kicker. These squids are not just peculiar, they're also incredibly speedy, boasting a remarkable velocity of up to 49.2 feet per second. First ever Mola Mola attack. In the serene waters surrounding Bali, Indonesia, resides a magnificent marine creature known as the Mola Mola, or the ocean sunfish. While these gentle giants of the ocean are often perceived as delicate beings, it turns out they value their privacy as well. In a recent video, we witness a colossal Mola Mola fish, encircled by a pair of divers who ventured a bit too close while the fish was in a vulnerable state, receiving a meticulous cleaning. Whether it was the intrusive lights or the daring diver antics, the fish responded with peculiar noises and even hinted at mounting an attack, leaving the divers in a state of absolute shock. The Squid Eye During their examination of a colossal squid's remains in New Zealand, marine biologists made an astonishing discovery. The squid's eye measured an impressive 11 inches across, securing its place as the largest eye in the animal kingdom. You might think such a massive eye would be terrifying, but in the deep, dark depths it calls home, exceptional vision is vital for survival, and those enormous eyes are a tremendous advantage. Colossal squids rely on their colossal peepers to spot and capture prey, keep an eye out for potential predators, and even find mates during mating season. With these giant eyes and built-in headlights, they're incredibly well-equipped for a sustainable life in the darkest corners of the ocean. Biggest Great White Shark In 2013, off Mexico's Guadalupe Island, shark experts encountered a colossal great white shark dubbed Deep Blue. This massive predator reached a staggering 20 feet in length, dwarfing the average size of sharks, which typically range from 11 to 15 feet. Deep Blue, estimated to be around 50 years old, showcased her enormous teeth as she approached a cage. Mauricio Hoyos Padilla filmed this incredible encounter, capturing the suspense as we watch this giant shark come remarkably close to humans. Finned Mola Mola This disturbing footage captures a distressing scene off the coast of France in the Channel Islands. 
a diver stumbled upon a suffering sunfish that had been partially devoured by sea lions. The video shows the Mola Mola in its agonizing state, still alive but on the verge of succumbing to a slow and painful fate, likely at the jaws of ruthless sea stars. Shockingly, it appears that Mola fish are treated like chew toys by sea lions, who first consume their fins and tails before engaging in a gruesome game of giant frisbee. Eventually, the sea lions grow bored and leave the unfortunate creature to meet a harrowing demise. Vampire Squid at a depth of 3,200 feet beneath the ocean's surface, you'll find one of the rarest sea creatures, boasting the largest eyes in the animal kingdom and bearing features resembling both octopuses and squids. Yes, it's none other than the vampire squid from hell, characterized by its ear-like fins and a sizable webbed cloak, which serves as an oxygen reservoir in the deep ocean. Measuring up to 11.8 inches in length, this remarkable creature employs yellow filaments as motion detectors for hunting and defense. Furthermore, when threatened, it has the ability to shroud itself entirely within its mystical cloak. In encounters with larger predators, the vampire squid deploys a cloud of bewildering phosphorescent particles as it swiftly makes its escape. Underwater Icicle When saline water seeps out of sea ice, it descends into the ocean giving birth to an eerie phenomenon known as a brinicle, or underwater icicle, with temperatures plummeting to a bone-chilling minus 10 degrees Celsius. This intense cold causes rapid freezing, and upon reaching the seabed, the ice spreads, encasing all forms of life unfortunate enough to be in its path. Creatures like starfish and sea urchins, slow to escape, fall victim to this frozen embrace. The video showcases a time-lapse of this unsettling hollow tube's downward growth, ensnaring unsuspecting creatures in a labyrinth of icy doom. Divers find transparent animals. Prepare to be amazed as we dive into a world of astonishing sea creatures captured by divers worldwide. First up is the captivating glass eel, elegantly swaying in its transparent splendor, a survival strategy for traversing long distances in open waters. But that's just the beginning. We also encounter glass octopuses, shrimps, and phronema, all of which have evolved their delicate, translucent appearances to outwit predators in the abyssal depths of the lightless ocean, where sunlight offers no warning before a predator strikes. Sunfish getting cleaned. Living in the ocean, sunfish have to deal with pesky parasites, but they've got an ingenious way of dealing with them. In this video, a team of enthusiastic researchers aboard a small submersible encountered a sunfish in its natural habitat. Initially, it seemed like the sunfish was on the hunt, but within minutes, it became clear that it was actually seeking a cleaning service. A school of smaller, cleaner fish approached the sunfish, delicately pecking away at its skin, and in doing so, they removed surface parasites that could harm the sunfish's health. Ancient Skeleton In August 2016, during an excavation near the Greek island of Antikythera in the Aegean Sea, a remarkably well-preserved skeleton of a young man was discovered at the famous Antikythera shipwreck. This ancient skeleton, estimated to be around 2,000 years old, was brought to the lab with the hopes of obtaining the first DNA evidence from an ancient sunken vessel. Alongside this discovery in 1900, the mysterious Antikythera mechanism, an ancient astronomical calculator, was also found at the same site. These submerged ruins, dating back to 65 BC, are believed to be remnants of a Greek trading or cargo ship. Giant Tiger Shark during a dive near Fiji, a shocking incident occurred when a giant tiger shark approached the divers. The footage captures diver Stephen Sim Shai Jai having a chilling encounter as the tiger shark seemingly attempted to bite his head. Fortunately, the diver's tank valve took the brunt of the shark's bite, with only a few inches separating the shark from a potentially fatal outcome. Tiger sharks are known for their size and strength, capable of overpowering individuals in the water thanks to their uniquely designed teeth. Skeleton Tea Party In May 2015, a man diving in a U.S. river stumbled upon a peculiar sight. Two skeletons seated at a tea party, both tied to chairs. The scene had an eerie and mysterious quality, with one of the skeletal figures even sporting sunglasses. 
The discovery took place 40 feet underwater in the Colorado River, near the border of Arizona and California, prompting authorities to launch an investigation to determine if the skeletons were real. Ultimately, it was revealed that these otherworldly figures were entirely fake, possibly created to generate more tourist interest. Mayan Relics in Underwater Cave in February 2018, archaeologists had a real adventure exploring the world's largest underwater cave down in Mexico. They uncovered some super cool stuff, like fossils of giant sloths, bears, creatures that looked a lot like elephants, and even a shrine dedicated to the Mayan god of commerce. But wait, there's more. This cave was like a treasure trove of human history with all sorts of artifacts left behind by our ancestors, like burnt human bones, pottery, wall etchings, and who knows what else. And speaking of that ancient Mayan shrine, there's a staircase leading to it, hidden away in the middle of the jungle. Fun fact, the Mayans used to toss offerings to the god, and sometimes those offerings even included humans. Mystery Pilot Back in 1944, a fighter plane went down in the deep waters off Corsica, France. Fast forward to June 2018, a joint French military and U.S. archaeological team embarked on a mission to locate the pilot's remains. After a lot of hard work and searching, divers made a breakthrough at a depth of 59 feet when they retrieved some sediment. However, since it had been buried for over 75 years, they need to do some more investigating to confirm the identity. The sediment will be analyzed for potential DNA traces in a U.S. laboratory to finally solve this mystery. Sleeping white tip Sharks It turns out that even voracious predators like sharks can have their moments of peaceful sleep. In a video captured in Revelagigedo, Mexico, divers stumbled upon a group of white tip reef sharks huddled together on the ocean floor near an underwater cave. Some of them were moving, while others remained completely motionless. Unlike humans, sharks alternate between wakeful and restful periods because they need a continuous flow of oxygen-rich water through their gills while at rest. Some studies even suggest that the shark's spinal cord allows them to swim while experiencing periods of mental inactivity, even when moving along the seafloor. A huge submarine in March 2018, scuba divers were enjoying their underwater adventure in the waters of Waikiki, Hawaii, and exploring the Yo-2 157 shipwreck. However, their fun took a spooky turn when a massive Atlantis sub unexpectedly emerged from below, startling the divers. This unexpected encounter caused a moment of panic, as they had to quickly react to avoid a potential diving mishap or worse. The Nest in 2017, at Basque Gilimeno in Indonesia, there's a mesmerizing installation known as Nest. This underwater circle consists of 48 life-size figures, captivating both couples and curled-up individuals on the seafloor. Nest's purpose is to create a habitat for soft corals and sponges, fostering the growth of various marine species. Its circular design symbolizes time and continuity, while the interlocking pieces serve as a welcoming platform for marine life to thrive and make the underwater environment even more enchanting. Temnodonosaurus Allow me to introduce you to the Temnodonosaurus, a large species of ichthyosaurs known as cutting tooth lizards in Greek. These ocean-dwelling dinosaurs could reach lengths of up to 33 feet and had enormous eyes that granted them exceptional visual capabilities, which they used for hunting with great ferocity. Recent fossil discoveries have provided evidence that these formidable sea dragons primarily preyed on smaller ichthyosaurs, which, surprisingly, were among the most lethal marine reptiles of their era. Bronze Statue's Arm Amidst a sea of heads without bodies and bodies without heads, another round of excavation at the Antikythera shipwreck site near the coast of Antikythera, Greece, led to the discovery of some remarkable artifacts. These newfound treasures include the orphaned arm of a bronze statue, a corroded disc featuring a bull motif, and a pair of well-preserved wooden planks. However, the most intriguing find was an unidentified object, the shape of which was unveiled through x-rays. While these discoveries are already fascinating, scientists believe that the chaotic remains of the Antikythera shipwreck may still conceal even more captivating secrets. 
The Thistlegorm In the depths of Egypt's Red Sea lies the renowned Thistlegorm Wreck, Considered one of the most awe-inspiring dive sites worldwide, this ancient vessel tells a captivating tale through its narrow, debris-covered underwater passages. Historical records reveal that this majestic ship met its tragic end on October 6, 1941, during a devastating raid. Struck twice during the attack, it suffered catastrophic damage before sinking into the Red Sea, tragically claiming the lives of approximately nine individuals. Goliath Grouper vs. Lionfish Two divers, upon encountering a colossal Goliath Grouper, decided to treat the fish to a unique snack, a lionfish adorned with venomous spikes. Surprisingly, lionfish happens to be one of the grouper's preferred meal options. But the question arises, can it consume this spiky delicacy without harm? As it turns out, the grouper employs a clever strategy to successfully devour a lionfish. If they manage to corral the lionfish to the water's surface, the grouper will ingest it head first. However, if the lionfish remains submerged, the grouper opts for a swift, one-gulp approach to avoid the prickly spines that could pose a significant challenge or even turn into a dire situation. Six Skill Shark Encounter Back in November 2017, the Blue Planet 2 sub took a dive to 2460 feet beneath the waves. And guess what? It ran into some massive six-gill sharks. So, the team was actually on the trail of a poor doomed sperm whale when they had this spine-tingling encounter with these nightmarish creatures. To make things worse, these sharks mistook the sub for a rival and went all out, shoving their heads and tails against the sub's window like they meant business. They kept at it for a while until they finally figured out the sub wasn't there to steal their spotlight, and they went back to chomping on the whale's carcass. Hydra Sea Serpent Back in June 2018, there was this brave diver who took a plunge into the murky depths of Bora Bora. And guess what they came back with? A jaw-dropping video that's all about terror, supernatural vibes, and something straight out of legends. Sea serpents. I mean, just the thought of them is spine-tingling. And actually encountering one is a full-blown nightmare, right? This video, it's got those creepy glowing eyes suddenly popping up from the depths, revealing just a sneak peek of what could be the legendary sea serpent, with multiple pairs of eerie eyes and monstrous features. But, you know, according to good old Scottish folklore, these critters are said to munch down on like seven whales at once. But hey, do these things actually exist? Massive Deep Sea Shark You won't believe your eyes when you see this. Forget about the shark's size, just its eye is enough to give you a heart attack. It's massive and downright terrifying. This video is all about the blunt-nosed sixgill, a deep-sea shark that's like a living fossil from way back when the dinosaurs were still around. This curious shark is like, what's all this light doing in the darkest depths of the ocean? It's checking out the submarine and those cameras with its electrical senses, but lucky for us, it's not looking to snack on the sub. It's on the hunt for something tastier. Perhaps a Megalodon So, we all know the Mariana Trench is like the ultimate home for all those crazy deep-sea critters hanging out at the bottom of the ocean, right? But like, how crazy can it actually get down there? Well, let's find out, folks. These researchers were all like, let's set up some bait and see what pops up on our camera. And guess what? They got way more than they bargained for. This ginormous shark-like thing showed up, and it's like a whopping 60 feet long, people. I mean, seriously, it looks like it's been around since the dinosaurs, and it's giving off major scary vibes. Is this the legendary Megalodon or what? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and let's chat about this mystery shark. Deep Sea Alien Alright, let me spill the deep sea tea, folks. So, there were these researchers doing their thing in a Norwegian fjord, and guess what they bumped into? an alien-looking sea creature named Paraphila, and it's a real head-turner, let me tell ya. This thing's got a dozen stiff tentacles sprouting from a chunky, bell-shaped body. Now, there's this legend that says this creature's never had a peek at a sunrise, and, well, it's stuck in its dark, watery world. These critters rock dark red and brown outfits and have mastered the art of bioluminescence, which basically helps them blend into the deep-sea disco scene. Oh, and they can even switch up their colors, grooving to the beat of those deep-sea lights. Size-wise, they're about 7.87 inches long, with a central dome that's around 13.7 inches wide. 
I mean, talk about mysterious ocean dwellers, right? Ruby Sea Dragon In 2015, some ocean-loving researchers from Scripps Oceanography and the Western Australian Museum stumbled upon a wild sea dragon that's basically a whole new species. They caught it on camera, this ruby sea dragon lurking about 164 feet below the water's surface. And let me tell you, it's got quite the quirky traits. Now, here's the deal. Unlike your regular sea dragon, this one skipped the whole leafy limb thing. The scientists think it's because of some evolutionary timeline stuff. You know, adapting to the wild and all. But here's the kicker. This little critter sports a prehensile tail, like a built-in anchor for when things get rowdy in the water. Nature sure knows how to throw us a curveball, huh? Let's talk about the thumbnail. This image likely shows an underwater statue or an artificial structure that resembles a human skeleton. It's covered with marine growth like algae and barnacles, which suggests it has been submerged for a significant amount of time. Objects like these are sometimes placed underwater intentionally to create artificial reefs or as part of an underwater exhibit for divers to explore. They provide surfaces for marine life to attach to and can help to promote marine biodiversity. It's not an actual human remains, but a creation meant to look spooky or intriguing for divers. So, that's our rational explanation of the image. What do you think? Do you dare to share a theory with us? We read you. Rex of Palau Who would have imagined that such a tumultuous period in history could give rise to such splendor? During their exploration of the wrecks in Palau, divers Jonathan and Julia encountered a breathtaking sight. These underwater treasures include sunken Japanese zero planes and enormous cargo ships adorned with vibrant hard and soft corals. Today, these wrecks have transformed into an underwater museum, showcasing an array of artifacts, from weaponry to poignant glimpses of history. Among these remnants, marine life thrives, creating a mesmerizing fusion of the past and the present in this captivating location. Thanks a bunch for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your pals. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ring that notification bell so you won't miss any of our awesome content. Thanks once more for your support.